We are presenting our report, which has just been released in its first draft form. And our report concerns the ways that we can select genetic monitoring units from a broader network of genetic conservation units. And also, uh, we are looking into the specifics how we are going to, to make these uh, uh, units being assessed, what are going to be the procedures, the sampling requirements, the costs, and so on. This report is, uh, I think, the first and the most uh, up-to-date uh, uh, work that has been done on the genetic monitoring of uh, forest trees. It's important on an international scale, and because I'm also involved in, in FAO similar uh, works, uh, um, I can say that it's uh, U4G now is on the leading scheme uh, of the world, uh, uh, similar efforts in terms of uh, 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 bringing up a particular way, a particular uh, protocol of how to monitor uh, the genetics of uh, uh, forestry species and in particular of the units that are under conservation. So it gives particular um, scientific base, reasoning and methods on how to establish a te temporal evaluation of forest genetic resources in order to see if several threats, for example, climatic change, uh, are uh, perhaps uh, making changes in the genetic composition of neutral and adaptive genetic variation. For the moment, we have established the conceptual framework of our work and the basics of how it's going to be applied. So if, if this work is to be continued, we have to present particular technical guidelines on how it's going to be implemented on the national level. It's going to take lots of effort, uh, but our idea is that all countries should be tuned in, within the same protocol so we can have comparable results at the pan-European scale. And our aim is to monitor the genetic resources and their conservation at the pan-European level. So the next, the next step would be um, to make a much more detailed effort and to produce uh, the means that all countries can participate in this effort by following exactly uh, the same common protocols. We have a very nice and vibrant group. Everybody has worked very hard. Uh, the whole panel in this conference has embraced our effort. We have heard very positive comments and very constructive criticism. So we're looking forward to continue working on this uh, scheme of genetic monitoring. And as I, I said before, we think that we can establish a base that can be important also uh, for the international scheme regarding forest genetic resources in other areas, in the tropics, and so on.